Even the most skeptical of believers of global warming can no longer deny that our planet is in peril. Everyone must do his or her part, no matter how big or how small. As a crematory, you have an opportunity to further your green practices by recycling your medical implants. Recycling is legal, ethical, and has even been suggested by CANA, the Cremation Association of North America, that all crematories should explore this practice. In this video, we will explain to you the life cycle of medical implant recycling as practiced by Implant Recycling LLC, based in Detroit, Michigan. Implant Recycling is the largest medical implant recycler in North America and is the only company known to collect, process, and sell directly back to the medical manufacturing industry. This video represents their practices and does not speak to other collectors' processes. As of January 2010, Implant Recycling has over 900 crematories participating with us. We estimate to date that over 65% of crematories are recycling their metallic byproducts. Implant Recycling's parent company, Umetco Inc., has been in business for over 30 years, and both its marketing director and managing partner are fourth generation metal recyclers. We are an ISO 9001 and 14001 certified company. If you are unfamiliar with these programs, in short, they are rigorous quality and environmental management programs that are audited by an external authority to assure compliance. In other words, implant recycling says what it does and does what it says every time, all the time. If you choose to recycle your implants and use a company other than ours, make certain you understand their entire process cycle, including collection and traceability, sorting, processing, and final disposition. Recycling your medical prosthesis is a safe, legal, and ethical way to handle the metallic byproducts of the cremation process. We strongly encourage you, if you have not already, to update your cremation authorization form. You should obtain consent from the deceased authorized representative, which can be a part of the routine cremation authorization each family completes. Both the Cremation Association of North America and the National Funeral Directors Association have suggested wording for these forms. Your recycling container will arrive promptly via UPS. Inside the sealed container will be shipping instructions and zip ties. Typically, operators will file the shipping label, shipping instructions, and zip ties for future use. Due to customer demand and improved equipment processing at our facility, we are now able to offer single stream recycling, also known as fully commingled, which refers to a system in which all recycling byproducts from the cremation process are placed together in your recycling container. What this means for you is that you no longer have to remove the medical implants from other recyclable materials, such as casket hardware and staples, which reduces your handling time and cost. At Implant Recycling, you can be certain that we carefully analyze and assess your waste stream and will handle them in strict accordance with local, state, and federal laws. Once the crematory operator has separated the bone and biological materials from the foreign objects, simply dump your cooled off hot box waste into the implant recycling container. This will include staples, screws, dental implants, casket hardware, and medical prosthesis such as medical titanium hips shoulders and knees. Once your box is full, simply secure the box by closing the top and securing the zip ties through the outlets. Call our toll-free number and we will arrange for UPS to pick up your material free of charge. Upon arrival, your container receives a barcoded tag that stays with it throughout the entire process. Your material goes through a custom design magnetic separation process. During this phase, Ferrous metals containing iron, typically from casket hardware, is removed from the non-ferrous metals, such as titanium and medical grade stainless. During the next step on the process, every metal that can be recycled is segregated by alloy content so that homogeneous batches of material can be created prior to refining. The analysis of material is performed in our on-site laboratory. Spectrometer technology and equipment is used to verify and control chemical specification requested by the medical casting industry. 
Once batches of material have been accumulated, the material is placed in a furnace and is made into molten metal and then poured into a mold to form an ingot, which is then packaged and sold back to the medical casting industry to make new prosthetic knee and hip joints. Implant Recycling offers compensation to crematories for their packaging and handling efforts. Whether compensation goes directly to a charity or to your facility, you should check your local laws. We are here to help guide and direct you through this process and feel free to contact us should any legal questions or concerns arise. Implant recycling activities have helped charities throughout the country, including veterans charities, children's hospitals, and cancer camps. Please feel free to call us with any further questions and we look forward to helping you.